The adventure begins. It's my first day being free as a bird, which means I can do whatever I want. So it's my first day in ages to go for a run. Waiting for the twilight, so why am I find my way home? Just as the light's right, why well, I can see the Pike best. Kingfisher, let's see what you got. To open up my lungs and breathe, open up my lungs and breathe. Taken by the majesty of the opalescent breeze. I'm so unfit. It's been too long. Kingfisher Trail ended abruptly. Now I find myself on a bridge. Beautiful. Okay, I've just done my run, which is good because it's been a while, I'm a bit puffed. I'm right now in a little place called Wilderness, about 500 kilometers west of Cape Town. And it's a beautiful little spot. It's so peaceful, actually in the wilderness. And I stayed at a place called Ferry No, right here, which is just stunning. Check them out, this is all the adventure stuff they do. If you're an adventurer, come to Ferry No. Morning. Good morning. That's a yeah. <laughs> That's more like it. <laughs> It's been an amazing trip, a very brief stay at Ferry No Backpackers in Wilderness. It's such a stunning place, you've got to come and see this for yourself. My experience has been topped off by the fact that I bumped into these two. <laughs> yes, this is Josh Roxton and Herky from up? Roxton Met Herky. Are you freezer bird? <laughs> <laughs> these guys make some amazing music, real African sounds. You've got to check their music out at Roxton Met Herky. Roxton uh, Met Herky. Check it out on Facebook. Twitter and the iTunes. The iTunes. iTunes. Yeah, that's the iTunes. best way. Buy my CD. <laughs> YouTube. Yes. <laughs> I'll play some for you now. Right. Take me back home to where the wild spirit rolls. Nobody throws a stone. This is a beautiful little one street village with just a few restaurants and bars. The three places that I'm going to suggest you check out are Kokomo for a party scene. They have live music every Friday and Saturday and good food to boot. Flavor for a bit more of a romantic meal. And be sure to come and check out the Milkwood Village. That's a beautiful scene like this. They have markets here on selected days, but I don't know when, so come and find out for yourself. This is what being freezer bird is all about. I was down in wilderness, ready to leave and go to Nisna, but I bumped into someone and they said, no, you've got to come and check out the map of Africa. And what it is, is it's basically this land mass here that some imaginative person has realized looks like Africa. It's such an amazing view. See down there, that's supposed to be South Africa. And this big mass is the map of Africa as well as just being stunning. The horizon is doing that funny thing where it disappears and you can't tell where the ocean meets the sky. Check it out. I've arrived at my destination for the day, Wild Spirit Backpackers. It's one of my favorite places in the whole of South Africa. Check it. How's it guys? Bit. 
It's funny how doing an adventure like this you make friends instantly as soon as you see a bike and a jacket. This is Peter and Ernie over here. They're having a day cruise around the wilderness peaks and uh, Peter actually has, uh, has stopped to chat to me because he runs this uh, adventure company. Tell us about Big Adventure, Peter. We do, um, we do motorcycle or, or adventure tour, tours in South Africa. Um, we've got a couple of these bikes, so we bring people in from where, or, where or, you know, all over the world um, and then take them around, show them South Africa, Brilliant. do some of this, um, this area here. It's got some beautiful passes and dirt roads to ride. So, yeah, it's an amazing country to ride. You yeah. Know, Oaks must come visit. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> Oak is something that uh, South Africans call people, by the way. So, you Oaks better come visit. <laughs>